As I started thinking about my favorite place, I kept coming back to a location that has provided fond memories for me from my childhood and now as a parent. My favorite place is Mount Lemmon. As you begin to drive at the base of the mountain, you are surrounded in the foothills by saguaros, choyas, creosote bushes, and other typical Sonoran desert vegetation. As you begin to climb in elevation, the saguaros and the desert plants are replaced by high desert grasses and shrubs, and even some smaller evergreen bushes. The climb gets higher and you reach a place where the plants seem to be overtaken by rock outcroppings known as hoodoos. Once you make the switchbacks through the hoodoos and numerous vistas, you begin in the forest areas with cottonwoods, oaks, and aspens. As you reach six to 7,000 feet, you start to come into the ponderosa pines and the oaks that will be your surroundings for the remainder of the trip up the peak. In the summer when the valley is in the middle of triple digits, you can drive up Mount Lemmon for a quick escape and have at least a 20 degree temperature swing. Mount Lemmon also provides winter activities such as sledding, skiing, and snowboarding. At the peak of Mount Lemmon sits Ski Valley affording you the opportunity in the winter to play in the snow during the day and come home for dinner at night. Astronomy is another benefit that the mountain provides. Many astronomers will travel to the mountain for stargazing to get away from the city lights. I would be remiss if I did not mention Summer Haven. Summer Haven is a small town near the top of Mount Lemmon. I remember visiting as a child and walking through the town made up small shops and private wood cabins as far as you could see. We would travel up the mountain just to have dinner or lunch in Summer Haven and get a cookie and ice cream at the cookie cabin. Now miraculously, due to the skill and bravery of the firefighters during the recent Bighorn Fire, they were actually able to completely save Summer Haven and Ski Valley. I've been through many fires on Mount Lemmon in my time here. And one thing that always happens is that new life will come from the ashes.